School administrators in Lompoc are asking kids to stand tall against bullying. They're working to curb bullying in and out of school before it gets out of control. News Channel 3 reporter Natalie Tavidian took a closer look at the program. Teachers say it's a bigger issue than we realize. My brother. Some have seen it being done to others. I'm usually teased about my weight. While others have experienced it firsthand. You see two kids fighting. What do you do? Educators are working to put an end to bullying. It's one of those hidden issues. Dina Kern with the United Boys and Girls Club in Lompoc says she hoped to bring the Stand Tall program to elementary schools. And so by being in the front end of this and not waiting till there's a catastrophe here locally, you know, we're going to have a, a better results. For and we've us. never had a program in place that teaches what to do about that. If you allow the bullying to happen, are you an upstander? No. No. Stand Hall will soon be implemented in fourth through sixth grade classrooms at some Lompoc schools where after school programs and campuses can work hand in hand. Helps them see how it relates to them and it gives them comfort. Raise your hand if you've seen that happen. The program teaches students to stand up for themselves and others, something Ian Alcox unfortunately experienced firsthand. We always get bullied about that, but not really anymore. When someone stood up for him... I felt great. I felt a lot more confident. In students in this fifth grade classroom have already started taking the Stand Tall classes, and they tell me the lessons are empowering. That I should really stand up more. Be proud and confident. With these classes, teachers hope their students will learn to do the right thing. They should go up to them and say to stop bullying them. In Lompoc, Natalie Tavidian, News 